working with text in Site Designer is pretty easy to get the hang of. With the visual workflow, you can type right on the canvas and use the clickable style controls to change its appearance. You have the ability to style text globally or in line. Let's give it a try together. From the content pane, click or drag a heading element, a paragraph element, and a button link element onto the canvas. With the heading element selected, the entire element may be configured on the Style Pane, Design, Typography section. Within the Typography controls, you will have the ability to change the look of the element. Browse through hundreds of Google Fonts to pick the perfect font type. You may apply a fallback font in case the viewer's browser doesn't support your default font choice. Change the font weight, size, and letter spacing in just a few clicks. Selecting the color box will launch the color wheel, where you may choose a color, grab a color from your screen with the color picker, or enter a color code directly. Align the text positioning center, left aligned, right aligned in just one click. You may also transform letter casing or add a special text decoration such as a strike through. The wrap control allows you to preserve how the text wrapping is handled. For example, if you don't want the wrap to accommodate smaller screens. The indent controls how far over the text begins in a line, and the letter and word spacing allows you to add extra space between characters for better visibility with thicker font types. The stroke control is an enhancement to your font choice. This allows you to apply a separate color outline, or a stroke, around the text. The base color is selected at the top of the typography section. Then to apply the stroke color, click on the color box to launch the color dialog. Next to the color option, you may set how thick of a stroke line you want the effect to, to be. Finally, the text shadow is a nice effect to add depth to your text. To change out the placeholder message with your text, just click on screen, or right-click and choose Edit Text. When you are done typing, the inline text edit mode will appear on the right side. The styles presented on the text editor are for adding inline styles. Let's say you want to make a word or multiple words in the element a little different. For example, you want to bold a certain phrase or add a link within a paragraph. That is where the inline text editor comes in handy. As you can see in the example, you would highlight the characters you would want to modify. Then in the text edit mode, add a class name. This way you can reuse the style later if necessary. Then select your style choices. By adding a class, if you plan to use a lot of inline links or emphasis on an element, you can simply enter the class name and the same styles will appear, saving you from re-entering them every time. As a reminder, to style the entire element, you will configure these properties on the Styles pane under the Typography section. And that's the 411 on working with text within the Site Designer.